So this is Super Bowl week. Hey, it's AJ here. Um, I would say bird blog, but I'm just going to say blog now since the birds aren't playing. But I am rooting for the Dirty Birds, Atlanta Falcons, that is. Um, and Mike Vick has decided he's going to turn his cleats in finally because nobody wanted to put him on their team as a backup. Um, I think at this point that's smart for him. He has probably other entrepreneurial uh, things he wants to pursue. But as a fan, AJ here... Now that I realize that I'm not going to be leaving the link, unfortunately, due to situations out of my control, unemployment, I have to go back to the link unless they decide to play me too and not take me back. But that's going to have to be my next uh, my next look at a job right now. So I guess I'm going to be a raffle girl once more for the season. Um, Hopefully everything will work out and I'll still find another full-time job. In the meantime, I'm still a link girl and 2017 will probably be even better than 2016 was. In fact, actually no, it will be because Carson knows what he's working with now and hopefully he'll have a lot of more moving parts that will actually move with him and not against him this season so that they'll have a decent record. I'm hoping for 11 or 5 or better. Um, this year, I think that because of everything else going on politically, I don't really think anyone's been paying much attention to the birds until they start doing some cap salary cuts, which is coming and looming. Um, the draft this year, like I said, will be great because I will be super excited it's in Philly. And some way or other, I'm going to get myself there. I'm just putting it out there in the universe now. I'm planning on going there in my Eagles tank dress and announce the big pick for our first round or second round pick. We'll see what happens, but um, all in all, 7-9 and nine for a rookie with no real wide, wide receivers was pretty damn good, but he knows he can do better, and it's a different league in NFL. So I'm rooting for Atlanta, though. Delco's own Matt Ryan is leading his squad, and I hope that they take it all the way. I wish they could have did it with Tony Gonzalez as the tight end, but, you know, here nor there. Um, and... Honestly, Lady Gaga looks like she's going to be a very entertaining halftime show, and I hope and pray that the commercials are worth watching. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of political stances now with the climate the way it's been since Donald Trump has taken over as the 45th president, and there's been a whole change in energy. But um, in the meantime, I'll be listening for the Eagles prospects as well as Phillies prospects now because we're going to be heading towards uh, the Grapefruit League, and it will be soon time for April to roll around in the first uh, bets. For the Phillies, so while I attended that tea kettle, I'd like to say, as I go to our postseason party tonight, I'm looking forward to a bright feature with my birds, and I look to another piece of um, merchandise to wear this season with Carson Wentz's name on it. And I hope to get a Jordan Hicks, too, later on the line once I get my money straight. But we'll see. That's later on the line. Anyway, here's to all those having a great weekend. E-A-G-L-E-S Eagles!